Good morning, Hot Tots, and welcome back to my channel. So this is going to be a more of a weekend vlog, and then on Thursday is going to be my little Q&A, and then we're going to start off the next week with a what I'm going to set up my week with in order to prepare for my two-week thing. Um, I may go ahead and start my two-week challenge for myself on July 4th because I don't have anything going on. My dad and my sister and stuff have a softball tournament in Nashville. That's usually where I go. And I'll probably, if I do anything, we'll do it like that Saturday and Sunday, you know? So Monday would be like a fresh start. I have Monday and Tuesday off of work. I took Tuesday off, but Monday we get off. Um, so I'm just really excited to like start off fresh and like have those days off to start so I can like really, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I'm excited. So I just thought I'd show you my weekend. I have two baby showers this weekend. Um, I'm about to get up and walk right now. It's about nine o'clock. I slept until eight. I have to go into the office this next coming week uh, really early because we have a project going live. So I'm glad I got to sleep in. I really wanted to sleep in this weekend because I really just wanted to be able to sleep in and just naturally wake up when I want and go on a walk. And so that's what I did both yesterday and today. And I'm excited. So anyways, I'm going to get go on a walk. And then we're going to get ready for our first baby shower and stuff. And then I'll, I don't know what all I'll show you today, but I'm sure I'll show you some stuff. And then I'll show you some stuff from tomorrow, you know, edit this and have this up for you guys. So I'm really excited. I have my friend Dana's baby shower and she's having a little girl and um, I'm having my friend Nick's baby shower. He's having like a co-ed with him and his wife Kaylee and they're having a little boy. So it'll be really fun and I'll see all my friends two weekends in a row, which is really nice. We have this big high school group of men and women that we all have hung out since junior high, basically like elementary, to junior high to high school. And so I love seeing all of them and a lot of them have had babies. So my one friend Scott had triplets, yeah all seven months I think but they were premature so technically they're like four months um and then so he they have triplets and then my friend Ben has a little boy he's so cute and then um I don't know if my friend Amanda and them are coming but they have three kids uh my friend Lauren has a little girl uh so just a bunch of babies are coming which I'm so I love I love kids and babies I love babies so much so I'm just really excited, but anyways, I'm gonna get up. I'm just gonna drink this water for now and then get ready, go on a walk. It seems a little overcast, like it may start to rain. I know it's supposed to rain later this afternoon, um, but I really hope to like get out there and get a couple miles in and it not rain all over me. I hope it's not muggy. I know it's in the 70s, which is super nice. So, anywho, I feel like I got some sun. You can't really tell in this lighting but I got some sun yesterday I went and just hung out at my dad's even though he wasn't there and I laid out at his pool and it was really nice but anyway all right let's get walking because I just want enough time to get back slowly get ready I feel really bloated because I'm about to start my period so I'm like dang it what am I gonna wear to this baby shower I feel so bloated and chunky you know what I mean and like I tried on these skirts yesterday and like the dress I was gonna wear it's like everything just looks to me like no so we'll have to figure that out Anywho, let's go on a walk. Wearing all black, and I'm actually wearing leggings, which I haven't worn leggings all summer, but since it's only in the 70s, I was like, you know what, it'll be fine. And I just feel like wearing all black because I feel so bloated and gross right now. So, oh, Ollie wants me to turn on the bathtub. Anyways, I'm gonna head out. I'm gonna put my hair up. I need to put some sunscreen on my face. I'll use the beauty counter one probably. The beauty counter one's the only one that doesn't break my face out. If you wanna invest in anything beauty counter that I know it's like a little more expensive, it would be face like foundation and their face sunscreen because it doesn't break my face out. It keeps my face skin healthy. But anywho, let's go. So pretty. Already not wanting to do this. <laughs> it is a little muggy out, which we're not happy about, but that's fine. I luckily don't have to wear my watch, I forgot, but I have 
figured out, like mapped out a two mile walk and then another one mile. So if I ever want to do two or three or two and a half, it's like I know exactly how much it would be. So I'm just doing the two mile for now. We'll see if I do an additional mile, but I don't know if you can tell, like not over there, but it's really overcast over here. So <laughs> watch it pours rain on me. So I just did two, it's like 2.25 miles I walked. I feel really gross, but I'm heading to Target really quick. A, I need to get a gift bag, which Target's probably the most expensive place to get it, but it's the closest place and I gotta get ready here soon because I'm gonna go grab a drink with my friend Megan before we go to the party. Um, but I wanted to hit up Target because I've realized I have, I don't really wear dresses and skirts and stuff. Um, I just don't and I don't need to in my life most of the time. But of course, like for baby showers and stuff, you kind of need skirts or a dress or like, you know, some nice short stuff. And I don't have any like cute flowy shorts or anything like that. So I'm just going to try to see if I can find something at Target. I also have no blouses, I've realized. I have either body suits or like long sleeve for the winter stuff. I don't have any summer shirts that are nicer. I just have like super relaxed workout or bodysuits, which I don't want to wear a bodysuit unless I can find shorts. Like, I don't know. So we're going to go to Target. Maybe pick up a coffee while we're there. Why not? Make it a thing, you know? Let's see if they got something. Looks like it's closed, so never mind. Not like I need more bathing suits, but how cute. Like a 70s look. So cute. Would these be cute with like jewelry? It is sticky and muggy out. I hope when we get to this place that it's like an out, an indoor thing and not outdoor, but got a big blue bag, just some white tissue paper. I couldn't find anything great. So what I did do is I did buy this tank top just cause I like it, this white tank. Um, and then I bought these shorts cause I'm hoping if I can find a white top or just wear that white tank with it and then dress it up with like a lot of jewelry in my hair. Um, these are like these baggy shorts. I didn't even try these ones on. Um, and then I got a monster. <laughs> Not that I should drink this, but it's happening. So I'm going to have a little bit of this monster. I'm just going to go ahead and take a shower. It's almost 11. I haven't heard from my friend. I have no idea if we're doing like... A drink before like she had wanted I haven't heard from her so I'm just gonna try to go home take a body shower and just like get ready just so that I'm ready you know what I mean for whenever and I'm assuming it's not like super dressed up I mean I don't know I don't know what to do like I do have a skirt at home I could wear I just don't know what to wear it with and honestly it's like a bodysuit would be best but I don't know if I feel comfortable just in a bodysuit with my skirt you know so this place was a bust whoever's the buyer for Target right now my friend's a buyer for these two different furniture stores and then she was a buyer before for DSW and stuff and literally she was always saying you can tell when the buyer changes because the vibe changes and I feel like Target's vibe has changed to very young like you know what I mean in like 90s which I totally get but it's like they don't have any like they're dress wear for like older women like women over the age of 25 is like peasant tops and knits and all these huge patterns and stuff and nothing like basic nothing like nothing that's in right now for our age like for late 20s to 30s to 40s to 50s like I didn't see any like like there's no like neutrals, plain white tops, cute little like tops that are like dress up tops, but are in like neutral colors. Like they have these crazy patterns with like waffle um, texture, but it's like a peasant top and it's 
supposed to be a dress up top. Like it just does not, it just, it's not hitting the mark for me. I mean, sorry if that offends you, if it's hitting the mark for you, so happy for you. But it's like, if I look at Abercrombie, American Eagle, um, anywhere online that I shop, it's like they have all these in things and Target, it's just so not in, you know? I'm like, and even their basics I'm not liking. Like, I can't even find good basics there anymore. I'm like, what is happening? So I'm gonna sit and try to figure out what to wear. I was really hoping to find like a white top, even with little puff sleeves or anything. And then even if I had to wear that with jean shorts or like my white shorts or my black shorts, I would have been fine with it, but I couldn't even find a cute little white top. So I'm bummed. Okay, quickly, I'll show you what I got them. I got them this cute mobi mobile, mobile, whatever you, it has little clouds and like, it's really pretty when it's hanging. And then I got them this huge swing. So it looks like this, how this picture is, only it's only all white and neutral colors. So super cute. I'm gonna go ahead and pack that up. I need to get a little card. I might just, I'm gonna make it out of paper and just like tie it on because I just think cards are such a waste of money, you guys. And I didn't buy a book, which I could have to like, you know. So I'm just setting this in here. You know what's funny though? It's like when people have um, registries, they can just see who bought what and when. So it's just funny that we wrap these things up and like hand them over to people. You know what I mean? When you're like, you know what I bought you, you saw in your registry that I, Sophie Daly, bought you this stuff specifically so nothing is a surprise but traditions man all right here she is in all her glory we'll puff this up a little cute okay oh no i'll save a couple extra pieces all right now oh i bought a strapless bra too because i needed one but um now i'm gonna take a body shower and show you guys the options of getting ready I don't know what to wear. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm wearing. You tell me if you feel like this is baby shower. Yes. I think I'm wearing it either way, so it's not like I'll get your feedback by then, but I was just gonna wear the shorts with this, but then I thought that's too dressed down. So then I just put it with this like little over thing and some little heels. Is this okay? Do we feel this is the vibe here? And I'll obviously do my hair and makeup, but. Ugh, I hate wearing dresses. I feel like I'm going to just wear this, but I hope I'm not like dressed down compared to everybody else. All right. I did my hair and makeup and this is the fit as we know. I like it though. I'm, it's growing on me a lot more now that I've been wearing it and it looks dressier with the jewelry. And now that my hair and, you know, makeup's all done and stuff, it's, I think it's a good outfit choice so these are my uh snake skin shoes <laughs> snake print fake uh shoes they're not very high which I love because I'm already 5'7 if you didn't know I'm 5'7 so I don't like to wear like super high shoes a lot of my guy friends and everybody else are like 5'10 so even with this I'm gonna be as tall as all the guys I know basically so anywho we're gonna Go ahead and head out, get everything in the car, and head that way. All right, guys, we're heading out. I'm starving. As you guys have seen, I have not eaten yet today. And I'm starving. <laughs> I had a long day. I did get some sun recently, so like I'm feeling very J-Lo glow. Too much? No, nah, never too much. Sometimes I do my makeup inside and then I don't see the natural light and I'm like, well, but I think it's fine. Whatever. All these men are married, so who gives a sh? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but anywho, heading out. These shorts were a great purchase. I'm finding out because you can dress them up or dress them down, these green shorts. So, you know. Thank you, Target, for the one thing that I found and this uh, 
strapless bra because all my strapless bras are like bandeau and don't have cups in them basically because I have zero cleavage. But when I'm wearing something that's like very form fitting, I want my top area, you know, to look more structured and to look good because I don't want them to look uneven or, you know, like all of those things because women's boobs are most of the time uneven and mine definitely are. Another TMI, whatever. I just don't care, you know? It's like my makeup's coming off pretty in here, but also very tan. Is it too much? In real life? Nah. Okay, anyways. I'll try to show you guys as much as I can. I don't know who's like cool with being on my videos and stuff ever. So I don't like to like record, especially other people's events. I don't want their family members and stuff in it. Um, they don't want to be. So I'll try to show you like the venue maybe and just like the food and you know, all that. But that'll probably be it. <laughs> I want to get so excited. Oh, man. Good morning. Okay, so this is going to be more of like a weekend vlog because. I didn't wrap up the vlog last night. You know, whatever. I am getting on an outfit. I have like my green shorts on today and I need to find a top. Oh, I was gonna check the weather. That's what I need to do. Um, To go out on a walk this morning. Look how pretty. And I think I might go to the pool today if it's not cold. This is my outfit. I'm tucking in this shirt a little because it's so long. I don't want people to think I don't have pants on, you know? <laughs> but I'm about to go on a walk. I need to get a hair tie for my hair. I always can't find one. So story of my life. Oliver, good morning. He's such a good boy. Oh my goodness. Were you so good? Yeah. He got turkey this morning. He always gets a slice of turkey every morning, but I try to make it seem like it's because he didn't pee on the couch. So like, I'll check the couch and I'll be like, let me check. And if he hasn't peed, I'm like, good job. And give him a piece of turkey. <laughs> Again, it's so nice out. It's like 70. Ugh, beautiful. There were tons of ducks in this pond by my house the other day, like, like over a hundred. I'm like, <laughs> but I think I'm going to walk four miles. We'll see how I feel. I'm going to do this loop twice. It's two miles. So I'll let you guys know. I didn't wear my watch, so I'm going to do that exact loop because I know how much it is. Just got in. Overall, it took an hour and 11 minutes <laughs> for me to walk like 4.2 miles or something, um, which isn't actually too bad. I was walking pretty briskly, I would say. And I'm sorry, I'm now just grabbing some water. I'm not really hungry or anything yet. It's 1040. I'm gonna down this water and then take a quick body shower. And then I think I'm gonna sit down and edit, try to get this video edited because I have nothing for tomorrow's upload. Uh, but yeah, so I'll edit. And then I think I wanna head to the pool and just like lay out for a little bit, but I have to edit my grandma's 90th birthday video too. And then also my video for tomorrow. So I'm gonna try to bust that out first. Oh my gosh, look at the birdies. These are my morning doves. They always hang out at my house, either on my front porch or my back porch. Oh, I love them. Baba, look at birdies. Look at the birdies, bud. Come here, come on. Look at the birdies. They'll jump up. Look, look at the birdies. You see them? Baba, you see them? Do you see them, bud? Look at them, bud. <laughs> you see the birdies? Oh my goodness. 
I know, I know. Bottles cost less than the cans, even though this would take up like four or five cans. I forget. I did the. These are cheaper, so I've been buying new two liters now since um, inflation is trying to take us all down. Okay. <laughs> Look, hella nasty. But now I'm going to, as this is exporting, just get ready. It, again, it's 12 12. I'm going to put a bathing suit on and then just go lay out at the pool. I'll show you guys where I'm at, but I'll lay out at the pool for a couple hours, maybe till 2, 2.30. Uh, I just like to get a little sun every weekend now and just make sure that I make time for that because it really makes me feel so much better. So let's pick out a bathing suit. We're not feeling our thinnest today because I had a couple days where I was just eating whatever. So we definitely want to wear black black on black on black <laughs> you know how it is so i might wear a black top and a black bottom i might try to find my tube top like when i'm laying out especially i kind of like to just wear a tube top so that i don't have a bunch of lines all the time but we'll see i gotta find it i had literally just had it where'd it go what am i doing I'm just going to wear my high-waisted black shorts, wherever the heck they are. Or maybe I'll just wear some tan ones. I have these. I can wear these. I love these shorts, you guys. These are the free people dupes because they just, like, look like they suck you in. They make you look so small. And, you know, these are not shorts that I'd say go walk a mile in these because they, you know, they're, they don't stick down. But just lounging around or, like, going to the pool, you know, whatever – I just think they like snatch your waist so nice. Ugh, love that for us, okay? I'll link these below. This is a cup she bathing suit too, I love it. Link that below, I'll just link everything below, okay? On my way. I think I'm just gonna write down like my grocery list and my to-do and then I'm gonna read my book so I'm just gonna relax okay just got back having a little water and I ordered two jumpsuits from Amazon I hope I like them um, I wanted one to get here before the last baby shower but it's fine so this one is like a of course, a beigey brown brownie color. Has a little cutout like this, and it's just two legs. Super cute. So I'll have to try this on, see if I like it. With like gold jewelry. So cute. Then I got another one, and this one is like almost like my bedding <laughs> color. And it's like a burnt orangey, a little bit more tanny orange, I don't know. And it's a one shoulder. And it has really flowy legs. And the back is like a scrunch. So I'm excited to try these on, see if I like them. I got size larges because I just never know. So let me try one on real quick. Here is the first one. The only thing about jumpsuits for me is that I feel like it almost like accentuates where my biggest issue is. Like I feel like if this were a little lower maybe, I don't know, but I feel like I look wider in this. So maybe if I wear like a shaper underneath, I just feel like these don't do me any favors. Like the pockets also go out right here and that's my biggest part of my body. <laughs> so it's like, here's me without the pockets, but the pockets stick out even more and this is already my biggest spot. You know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know if I like these on me. Not in love. I'm just making a late lunch of like a roast beef and turkey sandwich with a Caesar side salad and a little sparkling ice. I'm not really sharing points on this. I feel like because it's just like a weekend in the life, it's not showing every single meal I had. I don't think maybe it has, um, but yeah. Gonna make this and then just relax and watch TV for a little bit. Okay, I have 15 minutes. <laughs> Did my makeup, 
put my earrings in. Need to put my necklaces on. I love this necklace. It's from Jaclyn Hill. I don't know if you know her from like her makeup, but she now has like a jewelry line and I love it. It's really good quality too. Like, I just love it. Um, but anywho, I need to put my bracelets on too. I kind of need to hurry because I only have 15 minutes, so I need to be out the door. Don't know what I'm wearing yet. So <laughs> that's cool. I curled my hair yesterday, so I don't really have to curl it much. My hair keeps curl really well, which is nice for me. I think because it just has, a, it's naturally curly. So it's like we, we're supposed to be like this. <laughs> so I'm just kind of curling some pieces. And then I have that brown dress. I think I showed you guys it at one point. I got it off Amazon. I might be wearing that or... It's kind of like, it's in the 60s today, so it's not as hot as I thought it would be. So I'm like, oh, I could wear my cute little skirt with my white bodysuit and a jean jacket, which would also be really cute. And like more my speed, <laughs> that's more me, but I'll show you guys both of the outfits and you can comment down below which one you think I should wear and then I'll just wear whatever one I'm gonna wear. Oh no, I have like dandruff. My scalp is so dry. It's nice. So lovely for me. But anywho. Just curling some hair. This is my Hot Tools curling iron. It's like one and a half inches, I think, or one and one fourth. I forget. And it doesn't say on it, so. Um, but I love it. And I just like recurl these pieces. <laughs> But this has lost me eight years. So a lot of people are still asking like, is it worth it? Cause it's like 75 bucks. I'm like, yeah, dude, it lasted, it has lasted me eight years. This is like year eight and a half now. Like <laughs> the only thing I had to get a new one for eight years ago was because the cord was all crumpled up. And so now I make sure to not like wrap the cord around it. I just like loosely leave it wherever. And this has lasted me like literally forever. So, oh my gosh, my scalp over it. Okay, here's this. I'm gonna put a little perfume on my wrist, my neck. Okay, put my rings on. Okay, so just so you can see what I'm saying, should I wear this with this or like my structured jean jacket? Um, but you know, it's super casual. So it's not like a dressy, like baby shower or anything. So I thought that would be cute or wear my brown dress. I don't know. Let me try them on. You guys tell me, which I'll just figure out which one <laughs> either way. Cause you won't be able to tell me, but I am going to put this on Instagram. So I think I'm going to go with this. I put them on Instagram. You guys chose this one. So this is what I'm going with. I got this off Amazon. I'll link it below. Super cute and comfortable, but I got to get the F out of here. Heading into the shower. Her house is beautiful. But um, I'll show you guys if I eat anything, but I'm probably not going to film. Oh, so pretty. This is so pretty. Look at the cookies. Oh, so cute. Yum. Video for today, for today's vlog. <laughs> that was fun. Um, we had such a good time, and my friend Brittany brought her baby Jackson, so he's nine months, and I just played with him and just watched him the whole time. Like, I love kids, they just make my day. So it was really fun. I got some cute pics with my girlfriends and yeah, I'm ready to change out of this dress. It's super comfortable, but I just want to put a t-shirt and shorts on. It's 74 degrees, which isn't very hot, but I'm just feeling hot, you know? So <laughs> I just like being comfortable. It's hard for me to not be wearing leggings or like, you know, soft shorts and t-shirts anymore. So anywho, I'm heading home now. As you saw, I had like a little chicken salad sandwich. I had a little bit of pasta salad, some fruit, and I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. That's all I had. And then I tried like a little corner of one of the cookies, 
It was not my favorite, so I didn't eat. I just ate like a fourth of the little cookie and I had a little pink lemonade. So, yeah, it was super fun. I love, that was our childhood house that like we all got to like go over to when we were young and they're selling it. So they actually did sell it. They're renting it from the people they sold it to right now um, until their house is built. Uh, my friend's parents, who we went to, that's the house we went to for the baby shower. And so it was really nice to be in there one last time and like, you know, get some pictures taken and stuff like that. And yeah, so it was really fun. But anyways, I'm going to head home, change clothes. I'm not hungry, but around six o'clock, um, my friend Anthony was telling me that him and two of my other friends might be going out for a drink or something. So I might go and see them and say hi, um, but we'll see. So, anywho, uh, I'll talk to you guys when I get home. That's it for today's video, you guys. I'm sorry it was a little sporadic and all over the place with two baby showers, but um, I had a lot going on this weekend, but thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna go to bed. It's like 8.30. But please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't because it really helps support my channel. I post every Monday and Thursday. Love you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.